everybody's different and age is definitely one of the factors that, um, that, that, you know, calls for sort of nuance around programming. But I, I'll say this, like, you know, and I think I've talked about this on a previous podcast. I don't recall which one. Um, there was a study that was done in Australia um, that I think we talked about on one of our podcasts, actually, where um, an investigator took a group of women with osteopenia or osteoporosis. So these women had very low bone density. They'd never exercised in their life. They were, if I'm not mistaken, the no one was younger than in their mid-60s. They were probably, you know, in their 70s. Um, and these women were put on a pumping iron regimen. I mean, literally, like old school in a gym, picking up weights, walking around, like this wasn't like some fancy, you know, posh Pilates class. This was like pick up weights. And I think by the end of this study, one of the women may even got to the point where she was deadlifting her body weight. You know, like imagine that a 120 pound woman picking up 120 pounds off the ground. <clears throat> so while that was a great example, because it was documented in a clinical trial, there are so many stories of these things that you just see that I just have to believe that people are far more resilient uh, than they than they can imagine. And you know, I write about one example of this in the in the case of Barry. Uh, Barry is someone who gets mentioned in um, I think it's in the stability chapter actually. And you know, here's a guy who you know traded his health for wealth, right? Which is a pretty standard refrain. And then retired and had all the money in the world and realized, wait a minute, like I can't do anything. My body hurts so much. And if you look at Barry today, I mean, the guy's functioning better than he was 20 years ago. So, you know, I, I just, I think it really just comes down to being consistent and having a real sense of purpose around this stuff. And obviously you have to be smart about it. I mean, you can injure yourself in the process of these things. So, you know, having someone who knows how to kind of guide that, um, and, and using common sense is, is, is essential, but, um, I, d I would never want anybody to come away from this thinking I'm too old to do anything about it. I, I think as long as you're breathing, you have a chance to do something about it. Mm -hmm.